I've got about uh, five reaper test, or not five reaper tests, five kills on the Barrows reaper test, so I'm just going to bullshit around and uh, give those a kill in this video. I don't really do too many of these. Not RuneScape at the least. Yeah, just five regular Barrows Brothers kills. I got my regular shit here for that. Floop! As you can tell, I am very adequately Zerosian. There's also 36 minutes, uh, about, or so, until the, um, next Demon Flash mob thing starts, and I would much like to do a video of that one, too, because I enjoy those. So let's restore that. Always get a good little, little boost. You can go to the Zerosian altar if you've done that quest, and, uh, get a higher prayer boost, which is actually very beneficial. It's just out of the way. It's not something I'm keen on doing, necessarily. Alright, let's go this way. I always like to start at the rocks and just go around. Stop it. There we go. Broken into the crypt. Alright, let's back up. Let's hit him. Normally I just, you know, smack him around, but now that I got this spell unlocked, it's going to be a little more fun. I just recently reached 94 mage, so... You know, I, I like it. <laughs> I prefer the blood spells, but I've become so accustomed to, uh... Fighting demons that blood spells just don't, you know, ring to me anymore. Alright. Okay, so Guthin is the one I've got to follow. So we're going to try to kill all of them. Why? Because I like to possibly get rewards from every one of them. One thing I haven't seen around here lately is the penguins. And then again, I haven't looked. A slight bit of a lag on that end there. Asshole, reducing my mage, you son of a bitch. Alright, so, I'm reducing my mage again. Normally, he doesn't take this long. Right, let's go ahead and initiate that. Alrighty. Uh, all for my melee thing for fighting Eriske, I've got my uh, Lucky Chaotic Spear. I actually just got that. <laughs> I got a Lucky Chaotic Spear and a Lucky Chaotic Staff, so I'm just lucky all around today, I guess. Alright, big boy, it's back up. His ability, I've noticed, isn't really that good. It just drains your adrenaline. I mean, which is alright if you're PvPing and shit, which I don't do. I really don't do PvP as much as I'd like to be able to. It's not that I'm not able to, it's just... I don't like competitive play a whole lot in games, so it really just, you know, rubs me the wrong way. Alright, time for you, Mr. Prayer Drain. It's alright, a window decided to open for me, not one that I chose either. Right, there we go. Gotcha. Heal up. Alright, I hate doing this because I hate having to switch back and forth. And there we go. Yes, I have Balmung set as my uh, melee override. I just like a giant axe. Who doesn't like a giant axe? <laughs> you got hit with the last bit there. Hold on, let me switch back. Alright, and the last hit, I guess, is going to be done in melee. There we go, that took a, it took a second, but we got it. The only one I really have trouble with, uh, necessarily, is, um, what's her name? Someone the Disgraced, uh, can't remember her name now, I just, oh my, Linza, there we go, Linza, which she's actually coming up. Let's go straight to, ma to Mage. Come on, I clicked over, thank you. Alright, Not like it matters, bucko. Alrighty, I feel confused. Alright, here comes the fun part. I always do like fighting Linda. She's always like a nice challenge. And I'm going to need to boost myself up just a bit. And put on Protect from Mage and just suck all that down there. Oh, 
something like that. It prevents me from really having to use health too much. As you can tell, I like Zeros because I have a lot of Zero stuff in my overrides. Except whenever the animation decides to cut me off at the hip. Alright. Choke her out. Do I have to choke a bitch? Apparently I have to choke a bitch. Be too much longer now. I remember whenever I first had to first got to fight her, it was just the biggest pain in the ass. She was unfairly difficult. Doesn't seem to be much of an issue anymore. Alright, so I got that hit up. I like I just guzzle these things down as an excuse to use my restores. Try not to even use food too god awful much. God, I hate it when that happens. My screen keeps pulling up audacity for reasons beyond my understanding. I don't want to use you yet. I'm going to use you when I fight the big demons later. Ow, that hurt. I didn't even notice. Looks like I am going to need it. Choke a bitch. Should be coming up and available here in a sec. Right, yeah, she'll be down in a sec. We're only 90. Jeez, that wasn't much. Slight lag out on there. My cat's being weird, sorry if you can hear that. Boom! Always end it with a good finisher. I cough. I see you, Iris. Or Arya. There we go. I had to think of his name for a second. All right. Let's see how fast we can make it go this time. <sighs> All righty. Yes, I'm fearless. I wish there was. I think there's a way to turn that off. Isn't that the Doomsayer that can do that? I hate going through here. I have to go through this. And of course there's level 70 crypt rats, which always baffle me. Where are these rats when you need them? Can why can't I not summon these rats? <laughs> oh my god, die. Let me check out which door's opening. Alright, so it's gonna be that way. Wait, I went the wrong way because I can't go through that damn door. Alright. Alright. Now, I've been getting some lucky drops from this thing. I got, um, what is it? I got some Ariske stuff a while back. And recently, I've recovered, uh, recovered a Torag's chest plate. And, um, Varak's, uh, helm before. I really don't go bossing or anything like this too much, but this is all my death tasks, so... I'm at least going to get some of it done. If none, if not all, but just one. Holy shit, I did all three. That noise of that shit will always spook me to this day. Alright, let's kill you. Get rid of you. All right, hold on. All right, so we got you, and then this door should be the one that opens. It's all a bunch of skeletons, and they're all like not exactly immune to earth-based attacks. It's gonna go ahead and burn it all out. Now. Alright, kill you. I didn't mean to get bony Steve there. Alright, let's open this door quickly before that guy hits me. Uh, square. Here we go. Always like to try to beat the, uh, beat the guys to that. Like, every now and then you'll catch them whenever you're going through. Like, and, and whenever you open the door or something, I always try to beat them to the chest. Alright, I'm gonna go around to this side. Open it up. And there we have Gutha. I don't know if that affects anything, but I always try to do it anyway. I know I really can't try, but I hope to make it happen sometime. 
All right, let's see what kind of drop I got. Oh, wow, that is not bad at all. Guth and Plate Body. We will take that. Uh, I don't have room for the other stuff, so let me go ahead and eat some shit. Ring of Wealth shines more brightly. Uh, and we will just teleport our happy asses straight to here. That was actually pretty good on a first shot. <laughs> actually, it wasn't bad at all. Yeah, we got four more to do. God, that was actually pretty... Oh, pretty lucky. <laughs> got a good thing right off the bat. It's not bad at all for a drop. Um, let me check how long I've got left to the demon thing goes. Um, 22 minutes actually wasn't bad. I think I'll do one more run in this video. Um, I'm not going, I don't even go in for 10 minutes. Yeah, I'll go. I'll do one more barrels run and then I will segue into the next video and do a demon flash mob. I like to do some demon flash mobs by myself. It's like a nice little challenge. Uh, gotta make sure I got all the shit for it, though. And give me some fish. Let me throw that in there. I completely forgot those things were there. And, yep, give me another fish. Alright. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and boost my prayer back up, because I forgot I left it on earlier. <laughs> Alright. Boosh. Those will be ready to do again in a couple days, which I'm happy with that. Those are always one of the first things I always check when I log in as to how long I've got left to do them. Do I have a skybox on? No, nope, I don't have a skybox. Okay. I always like to check. Let's go to the Barrows. I, God, I'm so grateful for that quick teleport like this so I don't have to run through the swamp all the fucking time. God, that was such a pain in the ass. The aid of my recce and the in search of my recce quest. Oh my god, that was probably the most annoying thing in the world. That was more annoying than anything one small favor ever did to me. I would prefer one small favor because then I can at least teleport throughout the entire fucking world. Ow, that hurt. <sighs> All right, time to regen. All right now, Jen will be going. Jen, Jen, I'm using her name and everything. That's what she does. Bloop. Into Le Crypt. I like how it does the map over here for a split second. Guthin again. Okay, cool. Maybe we'll get some of your shit this time around. Really, I'm okay with any of it. I just want to kill shit. I like blowing stuff up whenever I've had a bad day. I mean, today's been moderately, you know, negative, but I'll live. Ow! Damn, you hit hard! I have never been hit hard like that by you. No matter what combat style I'm using. Seriously, that was... That was a lot, surprisingly. <clears throat> and down we go. My mage is down a little bit, but that'll recover soon. Alright, go back from Hammer Boy there. I think Guthans will sell pretty quick, too. I'm happy with that. Maybe I'll get another one. Or something close to it. Gotcha. Alright, so I got Torag, Drock, Kareel. Every time I say Kareel, I think of the fish. Or the little things that whales eat. Alright, Varak. I remember years ago, um, I think it was Tanoob Show did like a little special where they interviewed all the Barrows brothers and it turns out uh, Varric was like a pedophile or something. <laughs> I don't know, it was weird. It was funny though, I liked it. That was years and years ago, God, I miss Tanoob Show. I really don't watch many RuneScape channels anymore. It's kind of odd that I'm doing one myself. I like to heal up. Because I know Ariske hits very, very hard, surprisingly. <laughs> There we go. That was a good strike right there. That was a good way to start that off. There we go. Alright. Two solid good hits. Good solid hits, I should say. Gotcha. Straight off. Wow, that was good. That was probably the fastest I've ever disposed of Ariske. Alright. Time to go this way. Hurry up. Stop. Stop twitching. I hate that. I've got a couple other things running in the background. Let's get our rim. 
Let's burn you alive and at least kill you or something. It doesn't matter if I freeze you, you're ranged out too. Really, bitch? Choke to death, motherfucker. Yeah, I have a bad habit of using abilities way too early on. Alright, so... Start with you, bitch! Come get some of this ass. I don't know, at this point now you can like change the damage appearances so they look different. Like you can change the mage damage splats to be blue and so on and so forth. I can do that and I probably should, but I haven't thought about it. There's something I would like to do. That way I can differentiate how hard I'm hitting where and who. Mm, let's see. Let's go ahead and pop you up. Reduce the need for healing or anything like that for a while. It'd be funny if I got another Guthans, uh, Guthans chain mail or chain shirt or something like that. I can't bring the name of it now. Guthans plate body. It'd be fucking crazy if I got another one. That'd be fucking sweet. Alright, let's burn you and smash you with stuff. Now, sometimes I've been tempted to go through to the normal spell book, but the only benefit that has over Ancients is the, uh, skilling capabilities with it. Other than that, it's, once you hit Ancients, you're... Basically, not going to use any other spell book again unless you absolutely have to. Alright, pull you up so I can do some extra damage. <clears throat> Doesn't it look like if they're standing in the center, they get hit? Yeah, they hit 10 to 20% damage rate. I knew there was a benefit to it. Alright, choke a bitch. That actually does do a noticeable amount of uh, excess damage, which I didn't really notice at first until I started doing some Team of Flash mobs again. Like, I was hitting, oh my god, that's a lot. Like, I hit like 6,000 whenever I hit it, and I was like, oh god. Yes, that's right, I went slightly British for a little while. Alright. Choke a bitch! Choke a bitch! Alrighty. Of course, nobody outside is managing to keep quiet like I'd like them to. Alright, let's blow some stuff up. Final strike. Boom! Oh, really? Didn't even kill him? That's anticlimactic. Alright, on to the next. On to the big guy who's plaguing me. Alright, so I think this will be the last one for that because I would like to do the Demon Flash Mobs video. So, let's go ahead and see what rewards we get after completely obliterating Guthin. Which, I'm surprised it did him twice as the guy I have to dig into the crypt. I mean, I'm used to doing several runs of this stuff and, you know, the same guy being one of them, but never like that. That was fast. So, who's it going to be today? It's going to be that door over there. Can't go that way. Can go this way though, which will take me right to it. <laughs> well, at least be a faster route to it. Alright, so let's zip zap. Alright. The doink. Oh god, I forget. Crypt rats. Ugh. I don't know if the number of monsters you kill really has any um effect on the loot. I was told I was told before it does, and I was told it doesn't, I was told if you kill over 40 it changes everything, but I've heard so many mixed stories, it's kind of ridiculous. Square. You square. Looks like I'm going to beat him to it again. Alright, so now let's see what we get. After killing Guthin, of course. Choke a bitch! see what we got. That was, like, completely nothing. All I got was a tooth half of the key, which was... It's alright. I mean, it can get me some stuff sometimes. Eat a shark. Always get another shark. Always take it. Alright. So I'm going to teleport my fat old ass right here to Prithinos. Boom! And once we get there, we will do the cutout. Popping my knuckles.
Oh, God. So many bones to pop. <clears throat> Screen shake! All right. So, that was a couple of Barrows runs that were part of my Reaper task. And thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, if you guys want to see more RuneScape videos, let me know in the comments. Let me know what you guys would like for me to do. Bosses you want me to take on. Stuff you want me to do. And I will see what I can do. And until next time, I will see you guys later.